The long-haired whippet or silken wind sprite is a separate breed from the famous smooth-coated whippet and it is an intelligent, agile and easygoing breed. There are top 10 interesting facts about the long-haired whippet. I would love to thank Dreamtime Pictures, Coco and Rafiti for letting me use their photos and videos. If you like the breed and you would love to see more of it, definitely check them out. Links are in description. Number 1. Name there is a lot of different opinions about the breed's name. According to the International Wind Sprite Club, the breed was formerly known as a long-haired whippet, but the name was changed in 2016 to Wind Sprite. In Europe, they are known as Silken Wind Sprites. And for example, in Germany, there is even a separate Silken Wind Sprite and Long-Haired Whippet Breed Club, which is suggesting that they are two separate breeds and there are slight differences in body structure due to different breeding ideas. But in most countries, in the world they are considered as the same breed. Number 2. Separate breed the main reason why the International Wind Sprite Club changed the breed's name was probably the future breed recognition. It is because the name Longhaired Whippet suggesting that they are only a variation of the classic Whippet, which is not true. For the same reason, the word Silken is not used in the breed's name in Canada and USA. It is because the name Silken Wind Sprite is similar to another breed's name, Silken Windhound, which could cause troubles in the breed's recognition. Number 3. Origin as you can see, there is a big ongoing debate about the breed's name and recognition. And guess what? There is even a debate about the breed's origin. It was believed that the wind sprite was developed by crossing whippets with Shetland sheepdogs. But the breed's founder, Walter Wheeler Jr., denied it and he said that he selectively bred his own dogs in the 1970s with other whippet breeders that displayed observable evidence of carrying the long hair gene and that he developed the breed from this recessive gene. But later, modern genetic studies has shown that the long-haired whippet has a herding breed in them, most likely the Sheltie Shetland Sheepdog and probably a bit of Borzoi. Number 4. Family Companion Finally, now we will talk about something most wind sprite breeders and owners will agree, and it is that this breed makes a great family companion. The International Wind Sprite Club describes this dog as low maintenance, very affectionate, intelligent, athletic, easygoing, easy to train, and fun to be around. They are also very adaptable, and they will be happy with longer hikes and long playtime, but also with leisure walks or lounging around. Number 5. Appearance this is a noble looking, medium sized dog with very athletic body, deep powerful chest, elongated face with strong muzzle and elegant arched neck. The average height should be between 16 to 22 inches, which is 40 to 55 centimeters, and weight is typically between 20 to 30 pounds, which is 9 to 14 kilograms. Females are naturally a little bit smaller than males. Number 6. Coat the long-haired whippet's coat is actually not extremely long-haired, but it's definitely longer than coats of most of other sidehounds. The coat is soft and straight and it's slightly curled or wavy. The fur is visibly longer around the neck, but the length and type of a coat vary quite a bit from dog to dog. Majority of dogs also have feathering under the chest and on the tail, back of thighs and back of the forelegs. You can find this breed in any color, any color combination and with any markings. Number 7. Training it seems that the silken wind sprite is more docile, eager to please and more trainable than other sidehounds. Actually, many owners report that this is a very willing to learn dog that learns new commands very quickly, which is pretty interesting, especially if you compare them to other sidehounds who tend to be more stubborn and independent and the training is definitely not an easy task with them. Another great fact about the long-haired whippet is that it is common that they can be walked off leash. Again, if you compare this to other sidehounds, this is pretty rare. You should train the long-haired whippet with positive reward training methods since they do not respond well to harsh training. Number 8. Exercise you can see on the first side that this is a dog made for speed. And indeed, this is a great and fast runner and you should let them regularly stretch their long legs. They are great adapts for various dog sports, for example cursing or agility. 
This breed is quite playful, so they will love almost any kind of a play or adventure, but when they are at home, they tend to be pretty calm. This is not a hyperactive breed, but not a couch potato neither, and they need daily exercise, walks, runs or good playtime to stay healthy and happy. Number 9. Maintenance it's very easy to groom the silken wind sprite. Brushing their coat once a week is enough to keep it in great condition. No additional grooming is needed. Just like with all dogs, you should regularly check the dog's ears, eyes and nails and clip them or clean them if needed. Number 10. Health Generally, this is a healthy dog breed with a lifespan between 12 to 15 years. You should be cautious with some drugs and medicines, because the wind sprite's multi-drug resistance gene can make them sensitive to certain drugs. They are also prone to coli eye anomaly. Tell me in comments what do you like the most about the wind sprite, the long haired whippet, and what is your experience with this dog breed. If you are new on this channel, consider subscribing, turn the notifications on, check our Instagram, Facebook links are in description. Thank you for watching, see you in the next video.